Jennifer Lopez and Matt Damon made for a supportive duo last week at the premiere of Unstoppable at the Toronto International Film Festival. Matt co-owns Artists' Equity with Jennifer Affleck, who is Ben's estranged spouse and closest friend, and starring in the biopic drama about professional wrestler Anthony Robles. Jennifer made her first public appearance since divorcing the Argo star on August 20th, and the fact that she was there with Matt generated a lot of interest. Plus, at a subsequent private party, they were observed holding hands and apparently having a profound talk for a long time. Even though Matt is much closer to Ben, Jennifer and Matt have been friends for a long time and have been in each other's lives frequently throughout the last 20 years. Ben and Matt first crossed paths in their hometown of Cambridge when Ben was eight years old and Matt was 10 years old since then. Matt has been an integral part of Ben's life, and they are both famous A-listers in Hollywood. From the beginning of Ben and JLo's affair in the early 2000s to their engagement, the media frenzy that surrounded them, and finally their breakup, the Saving Private Ryan actor was there through it all. In 2021, he openly expressed his love for the pair and wanted nothing more than to see his best buddy happy. Thus, he was publicly supportive of their renewed romance. On the Today Show in 2021, when questioned about their recoupling for the first time, he was reserved, adding, It's a fascinating story, after claiming it was the first time he'd heard of the topic. That would be great if it were accurate. To bits, I adore them. That sounds fantastic. Luciana Barroso and Matt have been married since 2005, and Matt has often voiced his satisfaction that she is not involved with the Hollywood machine in an effort to escape the craziness that surrounded Ben and J-Lo's relationship.